guys, it is Tuesday the 27th and I got to get a workout in. Um, this morning I ran um, four miles. I got up at 4.30, busted that out and um, this evening it's four o'clock right now and I'm going to do a short strength training, body weight strength training. Um, so I'm following a training plan that um, really starts out slow. Um, I'm doing only about 20 miles a week right now and this week, well last week we started getting into body weight strength training meaning no added weights, um, just using your body as weight so like push ups, squats, um, a lot of flexibility. So today's workout called for a run and some body weight strength. So I'm going to do my body weight strength, I'll show you guys what my workout is and I'm going to warm up with a one mile run. Um, and then I will do probably about 15, 20 minutes of some strength training and then I'll cool down a little bit. So let's get started. while also working your flexibility and it's great for runners because you really need to build your ankle strength, your lower, all those small muscles that are holding together your ankle. Um, it works those really well. It helps build those muscles so that you're less prone to sprains and rolling your ankles. So that's a great one. To definitely incorporate that into your routine. Cool. Hey. This side? Uh, sure. Hold on. Let me. We are riding horses. This is Haley's pony. Mm -hmm. Hi, Spear. It, Spirit. How do you know? Go, go, go. Can you put. Yep. Yep, I can't. No, can you put it back? This thing. Push, pull it back. Pull it back. There yeah. you go. Thank you. All right. Ready to go? Haley fell off a little bit ago, but she got right back on. That's right. That's what it's all about, huh, Spirit? Come on, Spirit. Not on the road, you promise. <gasps> I'm slipping. You're fine. Come on, Spirit. Come on, Spirit. Come on. I did turn See my drum Come on. Today's Thursday, holy moly. It's Thursday, oh, let me see. Thursday and it's six o'clock. Um, got up at 4.30 today to do my run. I had an easy four miles this morning. Most mornings during the week, um, I run on the treadmill because um, I work Monday through Thursday and I have to leave the house at seven. So in order to get my run in, I have to get up at like 4.30 um, and then still have time to get ready, get the kids ready. So I do not like running in the dark and it's dark outside until like 6.30 now, 7. So I run on the treadmill in the morning. Um, don't really enjoy it, but you do what you got to do. So on the weekends is when I usually, when I get outside and take the dog and um, try to hit more trails and stuff. So um, I don't record a lot when I'm running on the treadmill because it's boring. It's dark outside until like 6.30 now, 7. So 
I run on the treadmill in the morning. Um, don't really enjoy it, but you do what you gotta do. So on the weekends is when I usually, when I get outside and take the dog and um, try to hit more trails and stuff. So um, I don't record a lot when I'm running on the treadmill because it's boring. I'm going to um, go get ready for work, get the kids ready. I have a um, strength session to do this afternoon. Uh, I'm not sure exactly what I'm going to be doing yet, but I'm going to create my workout today for that. And then um, I didn't film really yesterday because it was a rest day, not a lot going on. So yeah, and then tomorrow I have another four, I think Saturday I have five, Sunday I have six. So um, yeah, it is Friday morning. It's um, 5.15, I, oh, yesterday did not go to plan. Um, we were crazy busy at the restaurant, and then after I had to stay late and do some repairs. So I didn't get home till like 7, and I was planning on doing a strength workout. It didn't happen. I was exhausted, so I'm going to do it today. Um... I also have four mile runs, so what I'm going to do is do kind of a, uh, I don't know, interval uh, between um, running and strength. So I'm going to like run a mile, then do a few few rounds of body weight strength, and then go back and forth until I reach four miles. Um, so it'll probably end up being a um, 60 minute workout an hour workout um so it's still dark outside so i'm probably still gonna run on the treadmill but i'll show you guys some of my strength i have work today um i have to go into work for a little while and then um i need to clean my house because it is a mess and driving me crazy I'm trading out one of my miles for stairs. I'm doing 10 minutes up and down. She's doing stairs with me. All right, just finished my workout. That was a good workout. It's 6.30 now. And um, I am sweating bullets. And then I put it in the fridge while I work out and then and it's all cold by the time I'm done with my workout and then I get a cup of ice and I pour my this orgain protein shake plant-based 
uh, shake in here. I don't always use these grab and go. It's just sometimes when you don't feel like using a blender, it's a nice option. And then I'll put in some of my coffee. And it's like a mocha, mocha shake. And I'll stir it up. And it is tasty and filling, very filling. So to clean this house, look at it. It's dirty, we got dishes, we got boxes, trash. It's bad. Don't look. So I know in my last episode we talked about, or I talked about, um, intermittent fasting and I was starting to experiment with intermittent fasting. Um, so I, um, I'm finding that my body does react really well working out fasted in the morning when I get up at 4.35, start working out. Um, I do pretty well on an empty stomach for up to an hour. Um, like this morning's workout was an hour long and I started getting hungry, um, right at the end. So, um, I've been working out fasted in the morning, which I haven't done in the past. I usually get up, I eat a banana, a piece of toast, something. Um, but I've really been enjoying working out fasted. I don't have any cramps, stomach issues at all. Um, so, but by the time my workout's over, I'm like ravenous, super hungry. So I have been... Um, eating after my workouts, just like a protein shake, um, trying to stop eating earlier in the evening, and then usually I'm working out in the morning, so I work out fasted, and then I um, get some protein in after my workout, and that seems to be working really good. Sleeping still, but uh, I'm gonna head out. 
run, five mile run, um, in the dark. It's dark out. I'm back at home on my porch and um, <clears throat> man there's something about being up before everyone else and it is quiet I freaking love it I'm addicted you guys I don't know what to say anyway it's gonna be a good day I have a tough day of work today Saturday so the restaurant's gonna be really busy um, and I'm cooking and then it's my daughter's birthday she is six today so uh, I'm kind of bummed I have to work, but after work we are going to our local fair that's going on right now, and we're going to go to the fair and go on rides and have fun, and it's her birthday, so it's going to be a fun evening, and I'll take you guys with me to the fair, um, go see the animals, uh, and that's kind of what we have planned today, but I'm loving getting my workouts done early in the morning. I'm finding that it's it's um my whole day is better um i don't have to worry about it it's just great so my body's slowly but surely getting used to getting up early and getting it done in the morning so anyway i will see you guys later hope you all have a great day It's okay if they're a little big, because you'll grow into them. And you'll be wearing socks, too. They are so beautiful, hey? Where's your How's it feel to be six now? Good. Where are we? It's so funny to watch okay. scooters. What are we going to do here? Um, good. It's just great to <laughs> have a fair, just good. because it's Hayley's We're good. birthday. Good, good, good. What rides are you going to go on? Ferris wheel good. Ferris wheel good.
little tired. It's nine o'clock, time for bed. Haley. Oh my gosh. Hey guys, so it is Sunday afternoon at about three o'clock and I was supposed to run six miles today. Um, I let myself sleep in a little and I was gonna run this afternoon and I woke up to my back really hurting. Um, I've been having issues with my back the past, I don't know, six months or so, really. So I'm not able to run today, um, possibly not tomorrow either. So I decided just to take the day off, um, let my back rest, and I'm gonna do some foam rolling and some stretching. Um, took a nap, just been like really resting. I'm starting to feel a little burnt out just from, I've been working a lot. I'm gonna do some stretching and some foam rolling and then maybe edit some videos, play Barbies with the girls and call it a day. So anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Um, I know it wasn't too exciting yet. Next week my training starts stepping up. Um, I'm actually training every day next week. Every day there's something going on as far as training. I am start incorporating some speed work, um, interval training. So kind of excited to change things up and something new. So um, yeah, thank you guys for watching. If you like this, give it a thumbs up. Um, press subscribe to follow my whole journey to running 50 miles in April. Um, exciting things coming with um, my running and um, a lot going to happen with that. Uh, bye!